you for calling 20 Dental Care. This is V. How can I help you? Uh, yes, ma'am. Um, I'm looking around for... I need dental work really bad. I mean, my teeth are breaking off at my gums. Um, how do I get started doing this? Okay, well, it sounds like we do need to get you in for an exam and um, look at you and see what's going on. Do you want to make an appointment? I would like to, but the thing is, is, look, I've ignored my health for a long time because I've been taking care of my wife. She just recently passed away, and, I mean, I really don't have a lot of money or anything like that, but... I have to get my... I can't, I can't even eat. Okay. Well, let's get you in for an exam. Are you are you having pain? It sounds like you might be. Yeah, I'm having a lot of pain. Okay. Do you have any dental insurance? No, I don't. No, if I, if I had dental insurance, I wouldn't have been... I've been calling around for over a month trying to find a place. Uh, okay. To help me out. Okay. Um, well, I can give you the um, the cost for the first initial visit to see what's going on. Um, it's one thirty one. Oh, right. Forget it. Thanks. God damn it. Fortunately, you are the um, going to be the lucky recipient of of that the, of that compassion and that you know humans wow. reaching out to make a difference in other people's lives. You are a kindred spirit, sweet sister. I'm telling you, um, <laughs> I'm I'm an empath and I give till I bleed. So <laughs> this makes the world to me. Well. <laughs> It is truly our pleasure, honestly. It, like, like I said, I can't emphasize enough how deeply your story has moved us, and um, you're going to be a changed man. Oh my goodness! You just made my my whole year. Man, the finesse that would be our 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 weakest link. My best friend told me, he said, man, you, you got the smile of a movie star now. I said, I know they make me crazy again. <laughs> but it's, it, it's, certainly, uh, it's certainly given me more confidence, especially when I talk to people. I, I feel like I don't discuss them, you know, uh, and I, I do feel like they take me more seriously because, uh, well, I, I mean, I, I don't know, uh, uh, people that, that n knew about my teeth, because I, I kind of became antisocial there for a while, but... I've been going out a lot more and, uh, you know, finding reasons to go out and stuff just because I, I feel more confident and uh, it's, it's actually given me the courage to, you know, uh, be a more social person. <laughs> that it is. But know? I mean, <laughs> do you even do you even recognize that person now? No, I, I, I don't. I, I, I mean, I, I know it's me and I, I do remember that call now. Uh, <laughs> but uh no, that that was a uh, that was a broken-hearted me that, that I guess didn't know <laughs> what what to do about my situation. I was I, I was in a dark downward spiral, and uh, yeah, I'm I, I'm not there anymore. <laughs>
You know, one of the things that uh, we think, I mean, when you look at dentistry, uh, it gives you the ability to change people's lives. And uh, as a laboratory, you know, we uh, we're so excited to be a part of that. Yep. And, you know, locally, we hear about stories, uh, patients in need. And, you know, there's there's people, many people that uh, have the insurance to cover it. But obviously, there's some sect of the population that just is under a hard time and they need a little bit of help. And, uh, you know, you want to help them as the clinician and having a lab behind you to back that up, you know, can really help. So we hear about these stories. We heard about you know, Charlie's story and, you know, we were touched and, uh, you know, we wanted to get involved. And, you know, I think especially cases like this where they're larger than a single unit crown or just a little bridge, you know, they're a larger case. And that's a lot of the cases that I know Driven Dental is trying to bring in for its clients. Um, you know, you want a lab that's going to be able to, uh, you know, work with you on those cases and help you to become more confident clinician. Um, you know, having technicians that you can rely on you say, okay, hey, I can take on these cases that Driven is kicking my way. So we, we have a partnership that, that's dedicated to helping people. Uh, for years, we've been doing extracurricular work, meaning going out into the community, doing things beyond what we normally do. And so this was a natural fit I teach my dentist to do is to say yes. When people ask, say yes. And you ask if I could help this case because he called on our uh, Driven Dental marketing line and wanted some help. And I go, we can do that. And so it's just a matter of what can you do? Everybody should be giving back. And one of my purposes, my whys, is to be a good witness to bring God back in the workplace. It's my personal calling. And so there's nothing better than to give back to people who cannot afford what they really would like or what they need. Not that we could give to everybody who asks, but there, there does need to be some degree of charity that we routinely do. And so that's been part of our makeup over the last 20 years is to find deserving people. We call it a deserving diva program in our, in our practice. And we give a, des a deserving diva a complete makeover. And of course, Charlie's a deserving dude because he's got such a, a great story. He gives back to people already in his profession. He's a caregiver for disabled veterans.